hello welcome to my channel today i'm going to show you how to make papel picado we're going to be using this here they are a text so we're going to use a pattern a wire thread we're also going to use scissors glue an exacto and obviously tissue paper in different colors this is perfect if you're throwing a party and you want something hanging from the wall from the ceiling we use this uh, mexican parties and they look so cute so I'm going to put the patterns on my vlog as well. As you can tell, I have a piece of cardboard here because I don't want to cut the table. So I'm going to just stack the tissue papers all together and this is going to help you. I'm using, I believe there are five of them. So just make sure that they are the same size and that they're really like nicely folded here. I'm going to use my tags in the corners to hold the paper and this is not hard work but it does take a, a little while so i'm with the help of the exacto i'm gonna start cutting the shapes i'm just cutting the black part of this because that's the piece that is gonna come out of the tissue paper so it is going to look really nice you can get other designs you can make skulls you can make names you can make birds hearts a lot of things there's a bunch of designs out there that you can totally make we used to make this in school when i was in mexico and it was it always looked awesome all the colors everything is part of the fiesta the party in mex so you know this is something that uh, we used to do in school just to decorate our classrooms as well and um this is what i'm gonna be doing just cutting out the outlines and this is pretty cool that you can actually make the um, the letters, but it's going to take a little while. So just, I'm going to leave everything on my vlog so you can get the copy for this. I have two patterns that you can totally get for free. So this is what it looks like at the end. I already cut out everything and I'm just going to start cutting my tissue paper. You can stack a lot more. It might get a little difficult depending on how sharp your exacto knife is. But, um, I mean, you can totally add more. Now I'm not cut out the tissue paper. I'm doing this, this oval or circular shape on the bottom. And this is going to make it look so cute. And this is one way to do the papel picado. There is another way, which is easier. And especially if you have kids, they can help you with that. But I'm going to finish this up. And then I'm going to show you what the other one looks like right after it. That way you can try different ways or if you get tired you can use this for like the view and the other ones just to you know like a filling so the next thing i'm gonna use i'm gonna use the same thing the same colors i'm gonna make a fan out of tissue paper i'm gonna go one way the other way and now i'm going to fold it like this this is going to help me get a shape easier, faster, and without so much trouble. If you're in a rush and you just want papel picado in your party, you do this. You just do cuts. You can do circles. You can do whatever you want here. And it's going to come out in a pattern all along on the tissue paper. And it's going to look pretty cool. You can also use your hole puncher as well. And it's going to just give you a different dimension of it. So I'm just going to finish this up and this is what it looks like. Now the next step for this is to actually hang them. So I'm going to take my my wire and my glue and I'm just going to put my a little bit of the glue on the edge. And I'm going to fold my tissue paper with the wired inside or thread or I don't know whatever you're using to hang them or you can just glue like uh, use tape and put them on the wall it's up to you how you want to do it so I'm gonna do this and just fold very carefully the tissue paper and just alternate the colors one after each other so you can have a different view of them so this is what it looks like I'm just gonna continue with this and you can add the other tissue paper that we use or just put it in a different line 
I hope you enjoyed this video. It is pretty simple to make. If you have any questions, let me know. I'm also going to leave you a video at the end of this one, another tutorial. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. Give me a like. And I really appreciate you watching my videos. Thank you. Bye.